y'all i'm back with another reaction video and i'm gonna be checking out dave picture me now if you know from looking at my channel you know i rock with dave heavy and he's one of my favorite uk artists and he the reason why i even wanted to really even do reactions because like i feel like he since he's from the uk you know a lot of people probably from the united states probably not even checking on other people from other countries music and i was like man somebody got to see this so i was like let me put this on my channel but I honestly saw this in like somebody's comments as I was looking at other reactions of Dave, different music, and they said Picture Me was a good song, and I was like, shoot, let me check this one out. I've checked out most stuff by him, I think, anyway, but I don't know where this one is from or what, but yeah, I guess it slipped on me. Anyway, let's get into this. Picture me, 23, a bag of sold out shows. I made it out with music, had to call my bros. And this merchandise is popping, I sold all my clothes. And all these holes of ghosts, I got one real girl. Picture me, 23. <laughs> he said he only got one real girl. Hold on. He came on her spaz, I like this beat. I always say that. <laughs> I said popping, I saw all my clothes and all these holes of ghosts. I got one real girl. Picture me, 23, I didn't chase my dream. My mum wanted me to do finance, so I came off beats. And now I'm sitting at a desk with a two-two in finance, eating pasta on my lunch break while I'm scribbling my rhymes. And picture me, 17 in an all-black suit, laying still in a coffin, surrounded by my crew, giving half-heart apologies and watching why they bought. Whoa. Is he giving like alternate life alternate lifestyles that he could have had of what he could have pursued? That's what it seemed like anyway. Dang, he could have went the route his mom wanted him to go, doing stuff that he probably necessarily probably wouldn't have wanted to do, or he could have ended up somewhere in the streets doing something else. Two, laying still in a coffin surrounded by my crew, giving half heart apologies, watching why they bottled me or running when they shot at me or next up if you prodigy wait. I'm in poker G. Picture me a road bang. I hope that you don't know it's me, no face for the road, my G. Kill him in seven ways, lemon haze, how I smoke a G. They can get you out the beef. Pissed if you owe me peas. The boys try and piss take. Boy, what a miss. Hold on, bro. He going too fast. <laughs> Hold on, Dave. Slow down. Slow down. Okay. I smoke a G, they can get you out the beef. Pissed if you owe me peas. The boys try and piss take. Boy, what a mistake. I'll come back with a shot and blow your lungs out your rib cage. Picture me a snitch. Nah, I couldn't picture that. Picture me a snitch. Nah, I couldn't ever think of that. Picture me of a baby mom that didn't want to. He said he couldn't picture that. Okay, I like the concept of this. Wow, I didn't. Of course, I should have known it would be something like this. Dave is just creative. So basically, this is like him thinking of alternate realities of what life could have been if he didn't choose music or. If the slightest thing would have went a different way. He said he couldn't picture himself being a snitch though. That is something that's if it wasn't in the cards. Me blow so shit my talent go to waste like Rubinio. I've been involved, I've seen a road to the good die young and the back get life. And the ugly is the ugly, but picture me a legend worldwide and a strata known for words in the center. Tackle verbs in the sentence, it's actions in my letters. And I never compromise, no follow with the trend. I create my own style because I've got my own agendas. I've got new Hmm. So he liked the way he he liked the way he did things. Dang, this is this is fire. I didn't I didn't know what. Wow, I should have thought of that. Picture me. That this is crazy. And I never compromise, won't fall over the trend. I create my own style because I've got my own agendas. I've got music, all that matters. But what about the youths that ain't athletes or rappers? Hmm. What about the youths that ain't athletes or rappers? Picture you. I don't know your picture. Can you paint it for me? Or can you take out all the men that's gonna paint it for me? This is really motivational. I ain't that. I like, I like stuff like this. Oh, man. Get you thinking about. What you gonna do? It's like, especially being black, bro. It's like, rap people like, you know the stereotypical stuff. Either you gonna rap or you gonna play sports. Who play football or something? You know what I'm saying? What you gonna do outside of that? You know what I'm saying? Like, what is, what is your reality? Do you really believe in it? Like, I don't know your picture, can you paint it for me? Or can you take out all the men that's gonna taint it for me? Or can you take out all the girls that's gonna waste it for me? Or in the straight, how you gonna get to all these places for me? And if you can't, then don't worry, G, you've got time. But you just need to paint a picture or just sketch a job. Cause how you know you're going down the wrong road? If you're in a dark place and you don't select a path. 
bro, I just did a video on something basically talking like this. That's wild. <laughs> it's crazy. I think just like that, like, what if I go down the wrong road or like, you know, get distracted by things, you know what I mean? Like, it's life. You never know what can happen. I just, you just got to try to move the right way and actually paint a picture in your head. Have a draft, like he said. Like, you at least got to have a plan or some sort of plan. Just sketch out something. Cause how you know you're going down the wrong road If you're in a dark place and you don't select a path I picture you talking loads about goals and riches With a phone full of close shots, holes and bitches And a head filled with fast dreams I talk to God like it's RE About my picture cause I can't see I'm at war with my mind So I'm still the skeptic getting head like Hardy And I don't mind cause the man they're all speakers like parties I'm conflicted on this mission so I'm still in the midst With a black star on my waist like Quark Hold on bro, he... He barring up, and I'm like not catching the references. I, I heard Ed Hardy skit. Okay, wait. My mind, so I'm still the skit getting Ed like Hardy. And I don't mind, cause the man they're all speakers like parties. I'm conflicted on this mission, so I'm still in the midst of a black star on my waist like Kwame. Guys, are on my case. It's like I wasn't dialing banks with some pay while you were busy flicking shanks for a name. Or busy rubbing drugs with a tip up. Or you can call me Schofield. Why? Cause I'm a prison in my skin, but I won't ever have a prison in my picture. Listen to my scripture. Like teachers with teardrops, principles, a killer. All for the squilla. But it's not hard, it comes from a vin. So don't let anybody tell you to put drugs in a cling. And don't let anybody tell you you can't run, dance, sing, or be a baller. You can be a king. Now you can work a nine to five. If you this is really motivational. The mind is the strongest thing ever to me. And whatever you tell yourself is what, you know, you set your limitations by what you think you can do. And if you think you can't do it, I don't really think you can do it. Like, if you don't believe in yourself first, who you think else going to believe in you if you don't believe? You know this is this is a motivation. This is why I rock with him. Right. Facts. Facts, facts, facts. You hear the stories all the time. Rich people killing themselves and all this different stuff because they some say that they get in a loop of wanting to continuously ever forever get money you know and i just see it as if you're not truly doing what you want to do and having fun doing it like what are you doing it for like life is too short to be doing stuff that you don't have a love or passion for even though it may not make you the most money it's not about that to me in the end i mean of course you got to live and survive but it's like you know if you don't love what you're doing what you only here once why not enjoy it I don't know your picture, can you paint it for me? Or can you tell me where your batch of friends has taken you? Or can you tell me what your aspirations are, your dreams? Forget the money, brother, tell me what makes you you. Can you tell me where you wake up, what makes you tick? What makes you smile, what makes you laugh, what makes you sick? Bro, I lit, bro. Go check out my last, bro. The last video I just did where I just sat and talked about YouTube, I literally talk about stuff like this. That That's wild to me. That is wild that I just reacted to this. Can you tell me where you wake up, what makes you tick? What makes you smile, what makes you laugh, what makes you sick? Can you tell me why you're on this earth? Can you tell me why you're living? Is it in and out of prison? Are you trying to touch a nation? Or are you trying to touch a pavement? You get your picture, get the pain, and are you playing in a stadium? Or are you sitting in a station? You get your picture, get the pain, and you die inside the hospital, all this praying that he makes it. Dang. I don't know, I'm going to go back. But it's always interesting, like st all these questions that he asks, and I always just look at people and I wonder what, what is their end goal? Like, what do you see? Like, what is your life like? Like, what do you want to be? Like, what is your vision like? And it's like, I don't know. For me, it's unclear, but it's clear at the same time. It's just like, dang, this this is this some heat, of course. In the station, you get your picture, get the pain, and you fly inside the hospital. All this praying that he makes it. You're working with the surgeons and the nurses trying to save him. Are you buried in a grave for some pennies in a chain? A memory that fades, a picture you didn't paint. I bet the boys think I'm panicking. Pet cardiology, I'm managing. Stop saying that you beef me, it's embarrassing. I never had these pagans till my face was on this rapping thing. Now every other you is on the chatting thing. See me in a rave, it's black blades, like saves, call me Anakin. Music money. Hold on, he said, cut this. I'm on that motivation, but don't come for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop. 
managing Stop saying that you beef me, it's embarrassing I never had these pagans to my face was on this rapping thing Now every other you is on the chatting thing See me in a rave, it's black blades, lightsabers, call me Anakin Music, money, pagans, education, found my hand in it I tried so hard in my tracks to give a message But it's mess, cause I'll still get you shredded by some savages I swear you don't know pressure I'm Of course Whenever you're trying to do good or anything in life There's always somebody envious or jealous or you know people just wish they were you sometimes and that's just how it is sometimes and you just gotta be able to move the right way and carry on with your message and you know don't let it get to you to give a message, but it's mess, cause I'll still get you shredded by some savages. I swear you don't know pressure. Ask Jack High labels playing deal or no deal, like I'm no Edmonds independent, no pressure. My whole team knifed out to the socks, you should know better. A levels, no pressure. And my ex just text me, she should know better. I can still paint a picture, put a pen into my hand. It's time to paint your picture, my brother. Now you can go get it. Yes, sir. This is straight motivation. Straight motivation. It's like, was it portraying the other guy that you've seen throughout the whole video being a businessman? And that's basically looking like that's who he could have been, but he chose not to do that. Life is full of choices. What choice will you choose? Every choice could take you to another road. Like... Like I said, in my, in my oldest videos that I used to have, I say life is full of choices and like each choice can have a different road, a different outcome and you never know where something can lead you, you know? And it's just crazy. But it's your life at the end of the day, so it's your choices. Whether you let people persuade you or not, it's still your choice. This was some heat, of course. I don't even, what is this? Is this off one of his albums or something? Like, I checked his Spotify. Well, I haven't checked his Spotify for this one, but that's how I seen like most of his songs anyway. And like, well, that's the only songs that I have seen off of Spotify, so I didn't, I don't think I seen this one on there. I ain't, there's no way. But wow, this was some motivational stuff right here. And it, wow, it's crazy. This whole video is basically where my mind sits as of now. That's, if I, if you ask me where my head is at, I should just give you this song because that's where I'm at with it, everything right now and how I see stuff. But yeah, hopefully you got something out of this and you like this video. I mean, assuming that you probably watched this already, you looking at reactions. Hopefully you like this reaction, but if you haven't seen it before and it's your first time watching it with me, I hope you got something out of it and feel motivated but yeah i'll catch y'all the next video i do peace